Okay, welcome to model 15. On this model 15, I'll be showing you how to change your structural color. That is your, that, that is your column, beams, wall, slab, and every other structural member, the color of it. So right now, I'll have to change the color right here on this 3D view interface. Now to change the color of that, I'll say you should, you should navigate yourself to this, um, locate the vertical icons that we we'll have here and click on this one here that says layers and color settings. So click on this right now. When you click on that, it will show you a dollar box that has different colors for each structural member. So by, by on that dollar box right now, we will have to now begin to choose the color of our members because this one that came with as a default of the portal structure is not that okay, I don't like it. So I'll choose to change it now to what I want, okay? So right now, you can see the layers, the labels right now having different colors. So first of all, on my column here, first of all, let me go to my beam. I want to choose my beam. So I want to choose my wall first. And let my wall, share wall has, um, my share wall should be um, something of this nature. Or let me choose this. Yes, that's fine. My share wall should be to have that. Or I can still use green for my share wall. Let me go back to green, where it is green. Green for my share wall, dark green, or lemon, as it is here. This, that's fine for my share wall. And then I'll go to my beams, my beam color. I want my beam color to be green, deep green like this. Okay. I want my slab, my slab here, my slab hash to be um, this one here. And choose this is that's fine and then i want my share my partition walls which is the wall load so which part which, which is here partition wall here to have um gray yes gray and i'll choose to increase the this opacity which is which, which simply means that they like to be transparent i'll increase it to be at least this um standard like this that's fine and i'll say then my for my columns i can leave the columns like that and i'll say the columns i can choose to give my column this 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 color this two one two something i don't know okay this is for okay i can choose to use this color of my column basically so just copy it right now copy the color code and then go to my column and um, go to my column here column here paste here and choose to use let me choose what happened here I don't want that. Can't just okay. I can just use this actually for my column. Color color one four. But before it was here before I think so. Something of this nature. Just the color one. Um, color forty one. Say okay. And then let me just paste the one I want to use which I which I've got pasted before. I'll choose to paste it from this point here. Let me just something like this. I'll come here now and paste the one which I want. I don't know, that didn't copy. Let me just select my color here. Yeah, I want this something this color like this. My beams, my column, sorry. Okay, first and then okay it here. Yeah, wait for it to not change. So once you okay, find out okay, you now see your colors here. As you can see it here just now. You can now see how your how the color is here. Can you see that? You can see all our, yeah, this is fine. You cannot see how the building color has changed. So this is how to change your colors in Prota structure. So you can choose to change your color. I don't like the way the column is showing. I can choose to can change my, my column, uh, my column color and my, I think my beams also is not, so not this place, sorry, not this place. Um, just say okay and this icon here this icon here okay so this is how to change your color in portal structure i'll come here just now and then wait for it to show wait for it to show and then come here click back on this and just click back on this here come to this place to start to okay play with it a bit say okay I don't want that. Let me 
try this one no i don't want that try this one or this then come here adjust a bit a bit again and then say okay and then come to my beam my beam looking so um and take my share actually to my share what to this then my slack and choose my slab to be to have um my beam is to be looking to let me choose this let me choose this yes then my um beam was well, my slab was looking so dark let me let me choose this my slab and then say okay and check again okay this is a bit okay okay can i see my slab now my slab is not showing there as you can see our slab there i just to change my slab from don't have the same color with what 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 we have as the wall okay this will be the final one i'm changing i don't want so you can see that you can choose to change the color which you want anyhow you want it so the software gives you gives you the, the permission to change your color to your own preference so let me just sorry okay that's fine then come to my back to my slab back to my slab now choose that here as my slab here is all this one here okay that's fine that's my slab and i will have to make my slab transparent a bit let me just reduce the slab hash to this okay and then go this here right now okay that's fine so you cannot see our slab now let me see okay can choose to make my slab not, not, not to be transparent if i want back to the place and remove that transparency from the slab i don't want that let it just come up and show i don't know okay go to my slab change that just increase this a bit increase this um click on it okay that's fine then my share wall i don't know i don't like the, the color of that share wall again the share wall color is not looking nice to me again let me just can change that okay this one here yes that's fine and now let me just change my share wall to have the same color with uh, let me use i choose to use this such as my share wall or this my share wall or this yes that's fine also okay okay that's that's that, that's okay so i want this now for my share wall right i want this now for my share wall okay okay that's okay i can use that brand that's that's fine so this how to change color on your on in your product studio software okay this is how to change color as you can see that so basically we are almost done with the modeling of this building the next thing that's the less the, the only thing left now is the basement which will be on model 16 all right so you can now see how we have changed color of this building as you can see that you can see how we have changed color of this building to what we want to our own preference so this is how to change color so model 15 basically will be on how to model the parapet wall around this to this this these beams and then model 16 will be on, on on how to model the basement floor okay so thank you so much and god bless you we we'll love you and then watch out for the next